What's going on guys, Berserker here, and we are here with Starbound, yeah buddy. So for those of you that don't know, Starbound is a very, very early beta um, game. It's from the team that made Terraria, I think one of the designers from Terraria. And as you'll see, it looks super similar, but this game is just immense and it's just fantastic. You've probably already seen some of it. I've never played this game. I've had this game for several weeks since the beta came out and I was waiting for a friend of mine but we both kind of got busy with work so I'm gonna do a solo series and then you know maybe we'll do a live stream together or something if you're watching this um so yeah let's uh I've only got like 15 minutes literally because I have to leave in 15 minutes I'm in my work clothes and I just I was like I want to record really quick so we're gonna record a really quick 15 minute episode and then we're gonna call it quits and I'm gonna go to work and I'll see you guys later. So, uh, yeah. Um, let's go ahead and get started. Single player. Um, oh, look at that. I actually had a single... Huh. Oh, okay, so they did a character wipe. Okay, cool. Um, so I guess with updates they delete characters, which kind of sucks, but whatever. Let's create a character. Character creation. Um, I think I'm gonna be human. Um, skin color... Actually, that skin color is pretty, uh... Pretty decent. It's pretty pale. Let's go with this one. Hairstyle. Uh, okay, we're gonna go with oh, Goku hair. Nice. I like it. Shirt. Um, kind of like the the jacket. Okay. Pants. Uh, the pants kind of change the shoes. Okay. We'll have some baggy pants. Okay. Cool. Personality. Um. Well. Since it's kind of Goku, we're gonna make him all Goku-y. <laughs> Undi- Undi color? Um, I have no idea what that does. Hair color. Actually, you know what? Let's just leave it brown. I like it brown. Short color. Okay, here we go. Orange, orange, orange. Ooh, that's pretty brown. But maybe they have an orange? Oh, yeah, they do. Okay, orange it is. Pants color. Orange pants, yeah, buddy. And his name is not gonna be Fruit Picker. It's gonna be Berserker five six five three. Yeah. Okay, let's do this. Berserker five six five three. Like I said, never played this game before. I literally we tried to set up a server. I probably played maybe two minutes. I walked around my ship. New quest. There's no place like home. Earth has been ripped apart and you've been in search of a new home for some time. Finally, your ship has run out of fuel in orbit of an unknown planet. Before setting out in search of fuel, search your ship's storage for a matter manipulator. Press E to interact with objects. Okay. Rewards. Matter manipulator. Reward is also $10. Mmm, I'm full. Okay, dude, look how complex all this stuff is. Um... I think... How does this stuff work? Okay, so you've got to press E on doors. Um, okay, so we're out of fuel. Tech. Ooh, I don't know what that is. 3D printer. Human flag. I have no idea what that is either. What's this? Okay, so this is what I'm looking for. Uh, let's see here. Matter manipulator. Flashlight. Um, I don't know where I put the flashlight. Can I? Oh, okay, so if you right click, it gives you half. Okay, that's pretty cool. So some torches, some corn seed, okay. Um, wheat seed, cool. And a broken hero sword, that sounds awesome. And I also have no idea where to put that, so we're just gonna do that. Quest complete, well done! The matter manipulator allows you to manipulate almost anything in the game world. Okay. Shop class. It's time to search the planet for fuel. To survive down there, you'll need tools. To produce tools, you'll need to make yourself a crafting table. Use your ship's teleportation platform to beam down. Okay. And I believe the teleportation stuff is right here. Navigation. Okay. Um, Alpha Cenus Morris 2 Biome Arid. Threat level 1. Um, okay, so that's a forest, so, uh, oh, no, wait, this is, I don't know, let's just go here. Navigation. Authenticating. Authenticated. 
Oh my god, look at all this. Look at all that crazy code. That's probably real code. That would actually be really interesting if they used the actual navigation code and put it up on console. And that's actually like the game loop that they use. That would be interesting. So, I don't know why we're flying around if we have no fuel. And I don't know why this is how this is going to teleport us down. Maybe I'm choosing the wrong planet, which is probably a good chance of that, but you know, whatever. Um but uh yeah, hopefully you guys enjoyed the series. Uh it's it's one of those open-ended series I said I don't want to do, but I've really been wanting to play Starbound for a while, so that's what we're going to do. I think I really literally could have gone back to that platform that I was standing on to begin with, and that probably probably is what I needed to do. Or we literally just flew around in a circle and we were at the same place. Oh, oh look, at, these are all places we could go? Oh my word! Okay, let's beam down, Scotty. Warp to planet! Alpha Cenus Menores Dos. Oh, dude, look, there's like very little gravity on this place. Oh, this is so cool. Okay, press one. What does this do? Okay, so this is how I break things. So I probably get to upgrade my matter manipulator and stuff later in life. Okay, so I'm assuming this is like Terraria where if I break the stump. Tree falls? Okay. Maybe. 20 minutes later. Okay, seriously, I'm on a schedule here. Thank you. Oh, look it is. Oh, look how cute. And as you can see, like, it really literally is like Terraria. It's because one of the creators is from Terraria, so... You know, it kind of makes sense. If you think about it. Because if you don't, then, you know, it's not going to make much sense. I have no idea what this is. Coal. That's what coal looks like? Okay. What was this purple bush? Oh, I picked up a purple bush. Or destroyed a purple bush. Ooh, fancy. Okay, maybe this tree won't take nearly, like, 20 minutes to cut down. Maybe. Possibly. Oh, it's just my luck. It's going to take 20 minutes. Do, do. Do, 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 do. Give me all your wood. Unrefined wood. Strange seed. Ooh, fancy. Okay. So, how do I craft? Okay, so crafting is literally C. Good thing I'm a genius. Okay, I'm not a genius, but. Oh, I need 35. Wait, wood planks. Oh, okay. Oh, so we get two per. So let's make like 15 craft. There. Wooden crafting. Gra wood a bit. Wooden crafting table. Craft. Oh, dude, this game is so cool. Well done. Using the crafting table will give you access to a wide range of new recipes. Collecting fuel and visit a range of planets is the best way to find resources. By now, you've likely begun to feel hungry. Food can be found on a variety of plant in a variety of places, but in a pinch, hunting is your best option. Obtain some alien meat by killing a monster with a bow and cook it on a campfire to produce cooked alien meat. Yum! I, I've always wanted to have cooked alien meat. Eat. Um, crafting table there. Okay, let's refine some more wood. It's a lot easier to do that than large quantities. So, um, let's see here. Oh, I don't want to, oh god, oh god, I don't want to break my crafting table. I want to, like, level out the area. Okay. What was that? What is that giant chicken? I really, I don't want to know. Like, seriously. I really, really don't want to know. What is this? No, one or two. Oh, 
Oh, that is so miff. Yeah, I said Niff. Don't judge me. That is so cool. Okay. Um, so maybe I actually have to use... Maybe not. Seven. Oh, that is so cool. I guess we could do that. Just build, we're just gonna build a small little cabin. I'm assuming if, you know, this is actually Terraria-esque, which it kind of is. Um, we probably need... Um, like, walling stuff. Oh, and E also opens up the crafting table, that's pretty cool. Wood planks, wood table, wood support, wood door. Let's make one of those, craft that guy. Oh, does it actually use full wood? Oh, that sucks. Packed dirt, cobble brick. Um, wooden gates, wooden crate, wooden chair, wooden bed. Okay, so maybe this doesn't require backing then. Wooden, oh, wooden, wooden blinds? Um, maybe you can use, um, I don't know. I don't know. I really don't. Um, okay, yeah, I have no idea, but, uh, maybe you guys are gonna have to let me know if this works. Uh, let's see, actually, we can break this wooden plank back down. We really need a better matter manipulator. Place down a door too. Oh, so it has to be. Oh, that works. Okay. Oh, look at that. Okay. Now we have a door. Ha <laughs> ha. Okay. Um, hopefully you guys enjoyed. If you did, don't forget to leave a rating down below. If you want to see more, definitely let me know in the comment section. Um, give me some tips. Uh, obviously, don't give out too many spoilers. Obviously, it's a randomly generated game, so you can't really give out spoilers, but um, definitely be like, hey, you should definitely uh, make a furnace because that's important or something like that. It's probably going to give me a huge tutorial like it already is, but let me know if there is backing for the wall I need to get because I don't want like zombies and stuff spawning. I don't even know if there is zombies, but I guess we'll see. Um, yeah, hopefully you guys enjoyed and definitely leave a like and I will see you guys next time. See ya!